following massive demonstrations in Belarus, more than 200,000 on the streets of Minsk, calling for the ouster of the man described as Europe's last dictator. Here's ABC's Julia McFarlane. Tonight, Belarus taking a stand. Hundreds of thousands of people demanding the pro-Russian president in power for 26 years step down. Europe has not seen anything like this since the fall of the Berlin Wall. Our Patrick Rival is there. This is a place that even just a few days ago, people were afraid to gather in even small groups. And now it's just this river of people behind me. Dozens of protesters have given details of beatings and torture at the hands of state security. But that hasn't stopped the huge crowds taking to the streets for the eighth day in a row since last week's disputed elections. The police entirely retreated. Alexander Lukashenko is known as Europe's last dictator. Just days ago, he appealed to Putin for assistance, warning that if he falls, other post-Soviet states will follow suit. An estimated 200,000 people attended today's rally. The shout of the crowds is becoming louder and harder to ignore, right on Russian President Vladimir Putin's doorstep. Tom? What could be Europe's next revolution? Hi everyone, George Stephanopoulos here. Thanks for checking out the ABC News YouTube channel. If you'd like to get more videos, show highlights, and watch live event coverage, click on the right over here to subscribe to our channel. And don't forget to download the ABC News app for breaking news alerts. Thanks for watching.